Before we continue with the video, if you like what I'm doing here on this channel, please consider subscribing. It helps the channel a lot. Anyway, let's get back to the video. Welcome. Now this episode is just going to be a short tutorial request that I have received. It is going to be dealing with the topic of lens flares. Uh, a lens flare is in real life something that happens when light hits a lens through the different glasses a camera has and creates a sort of artifacting. Um, some people love lens flares, some people hate lens flares. I'm not here to make a judgment about it, I'm just going to be showing you how you create one in Unreal Engine. So the first step is we have here a completely empty level, so we're just going to be creating some light because the first requirement is that we have light. And we'll do this by going to Window and the Environmental Light Mixer and we'll add all the lights here except for Sky Atmosphere Light 1, we only need the zero one. So now we have a light in the scene which gives us a sign, sun, which uh, we can uh, move around with uh, holding down Ctrl L and just repositioning where we want it to be. And uh, from here we are halfway done. The next part is we need to have a post process volume to create the lens flare effect. So let's create one of those. We go here, we type in post. We go and grab a volume that is a post process, post, post process volume. Okay. Uh, then we want this volume to cover everything, so we type in infinite here, so we can make it unbounded. So now we have the post-process effect affecting the whole world here that we're in. The next part is going down here on the post-process, is we have a lens flare uh, section for it. And this is where we decide how the lens flare is going to look. So clicking in intensity will activate the lens flare, so you can immediately see what it looks like. And you can also go in and create a tint for the lens flare if you want to have like a certain color scheme or palette for the lens flares. Uh, if we do not want to have that, we can also change the, the bokeh size. The bokeh size uh, affects the, the different individual particles, how uh, large and how transparent they're going to be essentially. Uh, in addition to that, we can also change what the bokeh shape should be. And if you have a, uh, a texture for that, it uh, you, you can replace this. If we were to choose something here, it's not going to look great because I just have the default stuff. But if you choose one of these textures, you can see that it has this kind of effect and replaces what it looks like, essentially. Uh, Going back from there, we can also go to the tints over here. The tint up here is a tint that affects all the different artifacts. If you look like this, maybe you can see that there is eight different lens flare artifacts that has been created here. And that is what this last tint is for. This last tint allows you to go in and change individual array indexes of this lens flare effect. So if you go into the first one or uh, the, the zero element one, which is the first one, and make it blue, you can see that the first one over here is blue. And we can go in and change the last one and make it red, for example, and you'll see that it affects this one here. So all the individual lens flare artifacts here can be changed with a tint if that is what you want to achieve. So yeah, that's essentially how you create a lens flare effect in Unreal Engine. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you did not like it, leave a dislike. Leave any suggestions or comments you have down below. Subscribe and share this video if you want to see more like it in the future. That is all for now. Keep on learning. Take care.